a story of fathers and sons forged under the shadow of war. One of our C-47s went down behind enemy lines. From the studio behind God's Not Dead. We will go in there and bring them home. Actor Stephen Baldwin and Kevin Downs take us behind the scenes of their new movie, Faith of Our Fathers, on today's 700 Club Interactive. Well, welcome to the show. Father's Day is coming up, a day to honor fathers, celebrate fatherhood, and remember the influence of fathers in our society. Well, the movie Faith of Our Fathers does just that. The film begins during the Vietnam War with two young dads, one a man of great faith, the other a doubtful cynic, and both reporting for duty. A quarter century later, their sons meet as strangers. Guided by letters from the battlefield, the sons embark on an unforgettable journey and discover that the devastation of war cannot break the love of a father for his son. Take a look. One of our C-47s went down behind enemy lines. You want to welcome to read my Bible? Might make you feel better. Stand face to know. face with the younger me. We will go in there and bring them home. No idea how my dad died. Who's Eddie Adams? No idea. Why don't you try to contact him? Maybe he can fill in some blanks. I'm Wayne, Eddie Adams, son. I'll set the sights upon my father's Bible. I always struggled with my belief in God. But I'm thinking about it. There's a verse that Stephen keeps telling me about. Greater love has no one than this, that he lay down his life for his friends. Your dad got my dad to read the Bible. Joining us now, writer and actor Kevin Downs and actor Stephen Baldwin. Both are featured in the movie, Faith of Our Fathers, and we thank you both for joining us today. Thanks, Terry. Thanks. Kevin, let me start with you. This was birthed in your heart quite some time ago. Did you think it would take this long for it to come to fruition? <laughs> you know what? I, I don't ever question God's timing anymore, and His timing is certainly perfect for this film. We're celebrating the 50th anniversary <laughs> of sending the first troops over to Vietnam, and... Uh, you know, what a war to really commemorate and honor the veterans in a movie such as this that really presents the gospel in a very clear and, and intimate way. What was it that drew you to this, uh, the creation of this story centered around Vietnam? You know, it's an original story by the director, Carrie Scott, and uh, David White and I just w really fell in love. We wanted to do a love letter to veterans. And, and their families, mm -hmm. and really let them know that they're not forgotten uh, for the sacrifice and the service that they make for us. And uh, we've done a lot of films uh, collectively between Stephen and myself and David White, and I um, want to do a love letter to veterans. I think that sums it up, yeah. Stephen, how did you get involved in this whole process? Were you, did you fall in love with the story and the concept right away as well? I'm just a sucker for Christian filmmakers. <laughs> Okay. Kevin and Dave, <laughs> these guys, we did a movie called Six the Mark Unleashed a long time ago. Then they called me up later and they're like, well, we're doing this other one. No, I'm, <laughs> I'm joking. I, as you can tell, I like to have fun. Um, Faith of Our Fathers is, as Kevin already said, first and foremost, it's, it's sharing the most important thing, which is the good news. Uh, immediately after that, it's honoring veterans and their families. We were just talking about this a little bit ago before we came to speak with you. And we had an interaction with some folks and one gal was talking about, oh, my husband's deployed right now. Mm -hmm. So even though it's set in Vietnam, it's a story that's very relevant today. Yeah. Faith of Our Fathers is a movie that communicates the gospel, honors veterans and their families. And right now people can go to faithofourfathersmovie.com mm -hmm. and start getting tickets and sharing the opportunity of what the message of this movie is, which is the importance of honoring those men and women from way back when, right up until now and today with members of the military that are on active duty as we speak. And the legacy of dads, Kevin, mm. as well. The impact of a father on the life of a son. Yeah, yeah, you know, we have an opportunity as parents, both Stephen and I are parents, and, you know, we have an opportunity, all of us do, to leave a legacy to our children by mm -hmm. the decisions we make as parents. And um, uh, Faith of Our Fathers definitely highlights how important fatherhood and dads are and how much we need them. We need them yeah. so much 
and kids, they just want to be loved. They want a dad in their life yeah. uh, to love them and to honor them. And uh, I love this story so much because these sons realized through letters, even though they didn't know their dads, that they had two dads that loved them so much that they would give their life for them. Mm -hmm. And what a great parallel to the gospel. And then you play a sergeant who's hostile to the gospel. What change is that? I was only acting, Terry. <laughs> <laughs> That's good news, Steve. <laughs> no, it, it, I was saying that it, that it is ironic that, that when I looked at the script, of course, I love when Kevin and Dave told the story. They're like, well, who could play the really mean, ornery <laughs> sergeant? Baldwin, perfect. Uh, but no, I, I actually, uh, in my personal life, I, I, I try to be as on fire for for Jesus as I possibly can, and because uh, I enjoy it. Mm -hmm. um, and then to have this opportunity to play this really mean drill sergeant in the Vietnam flashbacks, it was fun. Yeah. It's fun to like play these roles where I get to challenge the actors and, and, and kind of make them step up with their A game yeah. and their performances. And I'll tell you one thing, in this movie, Faith of Our Fathers, not just he's sitting here, Dave White, you know, you're talking about David White, who is part of Pure Flix, who did God's Not Dead, one of mm -hmm. the producers and stars of this film. Kevin Downs is here, starred in Courageous. You know, you have yeah. some, you know, top-notch folks that are in Key Christian players. filmmaking mm -hmm. today. And the one thing for me is uh, the performances in this film across the board are amazing. Mm -hmm. So it's just a wonderful blessing uh, around Father's Day to communicate the message of fatherhood in faith of our fathers and the importance of what happened. Mm -hmm. It's amazing. In the war sequences of this film, you see two guys in the foxhole, in the trenches, and one guy with his Bible open telling them about Jesus Christ and salvation. Yeah. And that his real, real, true father is his father in heaven. Mm -hmm. So, A message that meets us all right at the place of need that we have, because everybody has a point of need. Yeah, and, and something to keep in mind, Faith of Our Fathers, even though it's set, half the movie's set in the Vietnam War, we designed it to be a film for families. And so uh, I encourage even my sons who were, you know, seven years old or so, uh, we sat and watched it in front of the couch and we made sure that the war scenes were tamed down. There's a couple of them in there so that we understand the setting that we're in. Uh, but it's, it is a, definitely a family film uh, because we want to edify families and we want to uh, really lift up dads in the process. I want to just mention that in, in the movie there's a scene where you visit the wall mm. where the names of, of the fathers of these two characters are engraved. You had a pretty emotional moment there mm. personally. Were you surprised by that? I was really surprised. Actually, to be honest, I wasn't sure we were going to be able to get the shots we wanted off. I mean, this is how awesome God is. You know, we went through the process of getting the permits to shoot there. And they said, why don't you come and shoot between 7 a.m. and 9 a.m.? We're like, okay. Uh, but, but you can't stop anyone from approaching the wall. And I'm like, how are we going to do that? Because there's people all over the place. Mm -hmm. And I kid you not, for two hours, not one person approached the wall wow. while we were shooting there. And, and, and the, the wonderful ranger that was there, he was so awesome. Uh, he was like, I don't know what you guys did or, or, or what you're doing, but I'm going to see this movie because what I just witnessed, I've never seen in my life. Was your own parting of the Red Sea there. Yeah, no, it was really incredible. It was really wonderful. But the first time I approached the wall while the, the guys were setting up the cameras, I literally, I, I, I remember it vividly. I fell to my knees yeah. and I wept uncontrollably, uncontrollably for 15 minutes. And it was because each name represents a story, a very unique story. And I have two uncles that have their own story. They served in Vietnam. And here we're telling a fictional story in Faith of Our Fathers of these two men that have their very own unique story. And just the length and size of the wall, 60,000 mm. people yeah. that didn't come back. It's a wonderful wow. memorial. It really so, is. Uh, I just want to encourage people. It, here's a great way to be a blessing to any veteran from the past actively on duty now and their families as well send them to faith of our fathers movie.com tickets pay it oh, forward just right? spread the word yeah pay yeah. it forward mm -hmm. exactly just let them know here's a wonderful opportunity positive message honors these people faith of our fathers movie.com well let me tell folks how they can do that that's faith of our fathers it opens in theaters nationwide that's on wednesday july the first take your family out and enjoy this movie pay it forward to a family that you know that is uh, paying the price in the military right now this is a film that celebrates faith 
freedom and fatherhood. Stephen and Kevin, thank you for being here. Thank you for what you're doing. Thanks. That's great. Gordon?